Hi, this is Kara from Kara Co Creative. If you're new to me in the channel, we do both done for you and DIY websites and all manner of online business systems. And today, of course, we're doing DIY. I'm going to take you over my shoulder into Kit, formerly known as ConvertKit, just to show you what it's able to do and then a brief little amount of how to get started with it. So I will take you over my shoulder and into ConvertKit. All right, so this is ConvertKit. And you can see here it has a nice little um, layout here where you can track the revenue that your business is bringing in. Um, if we come over here, we can see subscribers, landing pages, and forms. So this is where you would create forms. And you can even do a landing page without a website to get people to opt in. Um, subscribers, keep track of all your subscribers. Um, I also like to use a lot of tags to help track different actions that subscribers are taking. Um, send, of course, this is the main feature that you can go ahead and send emails to your customers. Um, so here we go, we can look at the builder a little bit. It's not as flexible as something like Flowdesk, which is known for its design, but you can create um, sort of nicely styled emails with images. You get the metrics as well when you send. Um, automate, so here's where you can go ahead and automate the sending of emails like a nurture sequence or welcome sequence. Here, what I have set up is when somebody signs up for an event, they get a tag and a confirmation email. Um, so that's a multi-step process. Um, the automation feature will only be available in the paid version of ConvertKit, um, but you can see that this is an option. Earn, there is also the ability to create products. And you see here, tip jars is another feature. So if you want to just give someone an opportunity to pay you for your free content, um, if they enjoy it, but this is where you can create products and checkouts as well. And I'll show you what that looks like. This is for a $35 a month membership, but the checkout looks like this. Um, actually here, view. So you can see what it looks like, but you can create these very nice, simple checkouts. Um, and then this will automatically link with the email marketing piece of it. So if you want to send an onboarding sequence to your members, there's a lot of functionality here, but something that actually um, is pretty cost effective. So if I come out, sorry, and log out. Sorry about that little oh, log out to all client accounts in here. Um, and I go to kit.com and see the pricing. Um, the newsletter, just this um free version um is pretty sufficient for a lot of new service providers who are just starting up you get that email newsletter startup um, and you also do get one basic visual automation that means that you can actually send your freebie on the free plan um, then we have this 25 a month plan which will give you those more sophisticated automations and also the ability to have more of them um, Creator Pro is something that most of the people that I work with don't ever have to worry about. You will notice here, though, it is dependent on the number of subscribers. So say you get to 215,000, you're going to be paying a lot more per month for these paid plans. Um, most of you can keep your list much smaller. And if you're actually getting to that level of list, you're going to be generating enough income that this won't be an issue. So to get started, there is a free trial option. So if you come to kit.com and go to start free trial, we'll go ahead and create an account. Oops, sorry, that's the name. sorry, at gmail.com. Make sure you have a valid email in there. If you already have an email marketing tool, there are some migration features. We're not going to deal with that. See what your audience is. Business name. Um, this is your custom domain. The, this feature is for when you are using the landing page. So if you're going to use a landing page without a different hosting provider, you would send them to this email. So you wanna make sure that it's simple. Um, I would maybe take out a dash. 
caraferra.kit.com. You could select what your business is, grow my list. And then you are basically in here and you can start playing with the features. Um, next week, I will jump in here and share with you how to get started with the basic email form and that welcome email. Um, but that's just a brief overview of the features and how you can go ahead and get started with Kit.